All right, guys, how's it going? Um, this is the start of, I believe it's day five of Dead Space 2 campaign. Uh, I've kind of lost count. I think it's day five. Uh, I'm starting this video a little bit early while we're loading up and everything uh, so I can make some notes here before we start. Um, it is Thursday, uh, February the 3rd, and uh, I am filming this from home, uh, which may be curious to some people uh, because it's a Thursday night and I'm not at school. Well. Uh, because of the really bad winter weather we've been having uh, down here, um, they actually canceled school for tonight and the rest of tomorrow. So I was able to come home uh, tonight when I heard class was canceled. I packed everything up and um, drove back here home. So I'm home on Thursday night, so it'll just be me commentating. Hopefully, well not hopefully, I know we won't have to deal with any uh, questionable commentary uh, on these videos. Um, so that's one note. The other note, uh, not really related to Dead Space 2, but just thought it, uh, I'd pass it along. I am expecting to get uh, Call of Duty Black Ops in the mail tomorrow. Uh, it said that it shipped from the, uh, the Louisville Center yesterday morning at 5 a.m. And I thought it was going to come in today, but it didn't. So uh, I definitely expect it to be in tomorrow. Um, so we'll have some more footage of that coming up. And uh, a couple of quick notes on new filming techniques we're doing real quick. Um, you may have noticed in some of my videos, especially Call of Duty uh, online, that when uh, you know I'm turning corners or shooting or something, uh, and the screen is 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 kind of jerking back and forth, that um, the center of the screen stays stays steady, but everything around it, like the icons on the screen and even the edges of the TV, are moving up and down for no reason. Uh, I think what that is is the is my camera's self stabilizing uh, control. Basically, when the person who's filming is shaking, the, the, the camera tries to adjust to that and it um, it uh, it overcompensates and tries to keep the shot steady. Well, when, uh, when the game is shaking or anything like that, uh, the camera, I think, is picking that up as shaking of the actual camera and it's trying to keep the shot, the screen, steady. And because it's trying to do that, all the icons on the screen and the edges of the TV looks like they're going all over the place and it's really aggravating. So. I'm trying, uh, I turned off, they call it steady shot on here, I turned it off and I'm going to try to try to film now um, without, with the steady shot off um, so that hopefully, um, you know, we will be able to uh, have the screen not be going crazy. Um, and I'm also... Uh, using the, the zoom in mic feature again because it seems to be uh, working quite well. The sound seems to be improving. So, um, We are continuing Dead Space 2. We are in Chapter 2. Um, or Chapter 2. What an idiot. Uh, chapter 8. Um, and we're going to keep going. I found a bench here. Let's see if we have any... No, we don't even have we don't have any power nodes, so this is unfortunately we can't do anything with it. I'm sorry if some of the if these holograms and stuff seem too bright. I'm uh, I'm upping the brightness here to try to get the really dark spots. Um, you know, uh, to come out looking better. So that door needs a power node too, which we can't use because we don't have a power node. So. Uh oh, got a zero G area. Okay. Why are my lighting textures all mixed up? You see, it messed up. You see that on the screen? Look at that. Why is it? Why is it doing that? That looks awful. What's going on? I don't know. Maybe the HDMI cable needs to like get started or something. Cause that looks awful. I didn't want to do that. Oh crap. We gotta do this again. Hold on a second. I, re I reloaded the wrong save. I absolutely reloaded the wrong the wrong save. Ah! I was about, I was like, we did this part. What happened? My friend Tyler started a single player file on here, and I reloaded his save like a moron. Oh, I hit continue, and it reloaded the most recent save, which was his. So yeah, he's on chapter six. I'm on chapter eight. I was wondering what the hell was going on. 
What an idiot. I reloaded the wrong save. Oh. Not a very good start, is it? <laughs> Reload the complete wrong save. Well, this is the right one. God, I was so confused. <laughs> I'm like, didn't I do this part already? Yes, I did. Oh, boy. Here we go. Alright. This is where we were. Now I recognize it's Strauss and Ellie. Okay. Thank God, we're back where we're supposed to be. Alright, how many, how many bullets do I have? And I'm trying to look at my... Okay. 73. I don't have a lot for my plasma cutter at all. I didn't want to use a health bag. I didn't want a stasis. <laughs> okay, I got all my controls mixed up already. I haven't played this in like two days, so I kind of forgot the controls a little bit. Alright, let's go through here. Well, we just, we just uh, started chapter 9. Alright. Through the elevator, up the elevator, I should say. Oh god. Oh my god! Where did it go? What the fuck? There it is! God damn it! Why does it keep going away and then. Shit, I hate these things. They're way tougher in this game than they were in uh, the first one, for sure. They're way tougher. Oh, it keeps retreating. What's going on? God damn. Get him! Stomp his face. Yes. Throw him. There we go. Now finish. Finish him! There's another one? Holy fuck. Yep. Ah, I need a different gun. What the fuck? That detonate shooting it at a corpse. Makes no sense. I'm gonna die. Yep, I died. Wow, do I suck right now. <laughs> well, that was really aggravating. That detonator gun's pretty stupid. Uh, I wasted money, I think, on that. Because, I mean, I have a... Uh, I have a grenade launcher in my pulse rifle, so I really didn't need the um, detonator gun, but... Oh, shut up, bitch. I already heard your spiel. He falls behind me. What the fuck's going on? I, I can't kill these things, dude. They are so much harder in this game than the first one. In the first game, they were freaking easy, dude. But in this one, it's ridiculous. What am I supposed to do? They, they come down and hit me and then instantly run away. I don't... Look. look and then he's going to run away. And I don't have any more stasis, so... I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Look, and there's more of these, uh... This is another regular Necromorph. I'm fucked. This part is retardedly annoying. Look, he doesn't die. Explain that. Look, and he runs away again, and I'm out of bullets. For the plasma cutter. 
finally. Holy shit. Look at this. How many times do I have to shoot him? Well, he dropped something. There it is. That's not at all what I wanted. There's a small med pack. Well, dude, I'm getting to the point where I'm kind of screwed in this game. I mean, I'm running low on everything. I'm running low on health packs. I'm running low on, uh... And where was he on my screen? Absolutely not. He was not on my screen. He came out of absolutely nowhere. Made no sense. And of course now they're not dropping ammo. I'm almost completely out of ammo. Dude, at the end of this game, I'm gonna be so screwed. Seriously, I don't have... I'm out, I'm out of ammo. I had to waste it on those fuckers. I actually had to waste my ammo. Medium med pack and oh boy, detonator mines. I'm thinking about selling that detonator back, dude. I really am. I think I'm gonna sell it back to the store because it, it's pretty useless. I mean, what the fuck? Not one of these things. Out of ammo. I love how I'm missing. I I love to know how I'm missing. I'm shooting right at it. I'm out of health packs, by the way. Completely. There we go. Dude, this game is harder than the first one, too. It is a lot harder. Thank God there's a store here. Oh, boy.